Uploading a video properly is a great way to strap a rocket to it and get as many views as possible. And that's what we talk about today, how to upload a YouTube video properly. Here we go. Okay, so you're on YouTube, which basically means you know how to make videos. And now that you've made a video, you need to learn how to upload it properly. So first of all, you click on the upload and you pick the file that you're uploading. Okay, in this case, it is my thumbnails that I, I do my my random testing with. So here, you put in your title. You'll see here I automatically have my description filled in through the upload defaults. The upload defaults is in your channel page, right? But in your description, this is where you would write what the video happens to be about. In my case, I also include hashtags because the new system allows hashtags. So you title your video, you describe your video. So this is the test video. Now, imagine that test video is actually a keyword that I'm hunting for. Today, I teach you all about test videos, deep diving into the world of YouTube and test videos. So this is a screen that you're used to. I've entered the description. You'll see here it's automatically generated a thumbnail, which is brilliant. That That's, that's a fantastic auto thumbnail. Okay, now, You'll notice here that I've got kind of a little bit of guidance here. This is an upload checklist from TubeBuddy. Now, it's very, very clever. It will actually guide you through the rest of this video. So, first of all, you write a catchy, a catchy title. Test video. Or, why is this a sexy video about tests? Okay, you write a unique description. Okay, that description should, once again, match up to your, your title. So therefore it reflects some of the keywords that are in there and then you make sure that you write relevant tags. Now your tags are down here. Now I use TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is a free plugin. There is a link in the description down below or you can go to alanspicer.com forward slash TubeBuddy and install it for free. It will suggest tags for you. So if I put in test video, you'll see it automatically pops up some suggestions down here. right? Or you can type in a specific keyword so have a look at the YouTube YouTube tricks, for example. I click on the little magnifying lens and then it suggests ones in here. I can go to trending. It will teach me the, the ones that happen to be trending right now. It will also suggest some ones that are the, the best ranking or the best ones for traffic or things based on your content. And then you can pick a few, right? And then you can insert them into your video. I'm going to pick a load of random ones because it's an example. And then I click insert into current video, insert. And ta-da, the tags are filled out. Okay, so you've now written your tags. You've made sure that you've got a click-worthy thumbnail, in which this case it's auto-generated one, right? But what you can do is go down here, create your own custom thumbnail. For example, I'm going to pick this one, click open, and then it pops down there. And at this stage, I normally click done, bearing in mind that it's currently private, and then I go to video manager. I then go back in and click edit on the newly uploaded video. Now the reason I upload in one screen and then come back in to edit is that you'll notice there are now some additional features that aren't on the upload page, which is the end screens, the info cards, the subtitles, and the translations. Now, if you want to learn how to add all of those, then there is a playlist in the top right-hand corner with individual videos for each. I then suggest that you add your videos to a playlist or your playlists, which are relevant to your video, and then either schedule your video to go live with a nice little message for Twitter, or simply go straight to public and then click publish. So that's how you upload a YouTube video properly. For more tricks and tips, there's a PDF up here in the description down below. Hit that notification icon so you're alerted next time I go live. Hit that subscribe button to get the next video. Go out there, start creating.